I'd like to start this video by saying thank you. This week, our channel reached 10,000 subscribers. 10,000 subscribers, that's amazing. What started as a little project during lockdown, we got the camera out when we got this, our first Uni, which is the Uni Caruso 12. We started doing an unboxing video, a few people asked questions, we did another video, and now that's turned into this full channel where we're inspiring people, we're teaching people how to cook great pizzas, and we're having a lot of fun with it too. So really, really thank you from the bottom of my heart for all of your support. So in today's video, I wanted to show you how to clean your Uni pizza stone. So let's get started. One of the most common questions I get on this channel is how to clean your pizza stone. Now it happens to us all, sometimes a launch goes wrong, you spill a bit of cheese, a bit of tomato and it bakes onto that stone. Now luckily these ovens are self-cleaning but there is a method to help you clean your pizza stone. Now, as you can tell, our pizza stone isn't actually that bad. So we thought we'll have a bit of fun with this video. We're gonna spread some tomato, some cheese on there, get it really, really dirty, bake all that on, and then clean it off again. Okay, so we'll get a bit of uh, tomato on there. Spread that around. Cheese is always falling off the pizza. Some of that on there. Always spilling a bit of cornmeal as well. Or a bit of flour. mix that all in make a right old mess on here and then let's cook that at a high temperature to really bake it on our stone's nice and dirty we've turned the oven on we're going to bake all that on there and then see how it looks So as you can see, our pizza stone is now nicely messed up. Now, if your pizza stone looks something like this, all we're going to do is put the pizza stone back in and turn the heat up to the highest level. Now, if you've got a gas oven, it's nice and easy. All you do is turn that up to the highest setting. If you're using wood or charcoal, fill the basket up nice and full put some wood chunks on top, heat it up really hot and leave it for 30 minutes. So we're gonna check back in 30 minutes and see how this looks. So we've had our pizza oven running at high temperature for about 30 minutes now. As you can see, all of that food has now turned to a burned on crispy char that's just gonna brush right off. So I recommend getting one of these from Uni. It's a wire brush with a scraper on the end. We're gonna scrape away all the big chunks of food and then brush it and you'll see how clean it ends up afterwards. So we're gonna scrape some of that food just to loosen it all up. And then use our brush to brush it all to the side. Now, as you can see, that's already looking much, much better. But if you've still got some black spots on your pizza stone, leave it for another 10 minutes and then give it another brush. It'll come up looking lovely. So it's very, very easy to clean your pizza stone. If you're pushed for time and you want a quicker way to do it, there is a really simple way. All you have to do is just pull the pizza stone out when it's cool, of course, flip it over and put it back in. Over the next few cooks, that pizza stone's gonna clean on the top and the bottom, and it'll come out looking amazing. Thanks so much, guys, for watching this video. I hope you found it useful. If you did find it useful, please remember to leave me a like and a subscribe and a comment in the comment section below. And again, thank you so, so much for the 10,000 subscribers. It's really inspirational for me to make more videos for you guys to enjoy. Thanks very much, and we'll see you next time for more pizza-making videos. Oh,